until the light disappears, which is spectacular. A rare celestial event happening on Monday, April 8th across North America. Depending on the location, the solar eclipse will look different. Here in Calgary, we'll see a partial eclipse, and experts say with the right preparations, it'll still be a spectacle worth looking up for. The excitement grows as the event approaches, and some are already making plans. I missed the last one, so I'm going to see this one. They'll head out to the sandy, sandy park, I think, uh, by the river to go watch the eclipse. I'm a little worried about damaging my eyes, so I don't know if I'll be able to watch it just because I know normal sunglasses won't work. I might just watch a video or live stream of it. It's a little scary, but it'll be fine. While the best views will be from the East Coast, Calgary will see part of it. The way it's going to travel is like from down in Mexico, uh, up uh, through Texas, the eastern seaboard of the U.S., and then uh, eastern Canada, and then into the ocean. So in Calgary, the partial eclipse will look like a big round cookie where somebody took a bite out of it. Several events have been planned across the city. Telescopes will be available, and some will also provide special glasses to watch the eclipse safely. Schools also sent communications to warn parents about the serious impacts on vision if viewing the eclipse and protected. Students will remain indoors during that period of time. They're going to have their lunch break and <laughs> do different activities inside. Experts say the solar eclipse will last about two hours, starting after 11.30 in the morning and wrapping up about 1.30 p.m. If you miss it... They say the next solar eclipse will happen in 20 years, when a total eclipse will be visible from the western coast. In Calgary, Silvia Naranjo, City News.